right, let me see if I remember how to do this. What's happening, y'all? It's me, your resident supervillain, Mr. J. Washington. And I'm back, and I'm here with my reaction for the Beetlejuice, Beetlejuice teaser trailer. Um, first and foremost, thank you to everybody who's been following along with the stand-up career, the acting, everything else has been going on, man. As you can tell, that's why I've been gone. Uh, I should have been back to doing this. We were on the strikes, everything. It was just, everything was wild, but nonetheless... I mean, I figured, let me see if I can come back to this and come back to my YouTube and all other things and, and try to just add on more to the plate and continue to do what I've been doing. And so that's what brings me to here at this moment with y'all. Um, I'm a fan of the Beetlejuice movie, the first one. I rewatch it several times. I'm not going to even lie. I was a fan somewhat of the Beetlejuice cartoon, you know? I feel like. I need to hear the line, though I know I may be, though I know I should be wary, still I venture someplace scary, go see Hauntings I Turn Loose, Beetlejuice, Beetlejuice, Beetlejuice. I feel like things like that I should hear in this movie, but um, I, like many, were excited to hear it was a sequel, to hear Jenna Ortega being brought into it as um, Winona Wyatt's daughter, uh, what was her, Lydia's daughter, and so... It's going to be interesting, especially them having to make sure Jeffrey Jones is gone because bro locked up on some charges. You can do the research for that. So, because you know he's not going to be in it. To see Michael Keaton reprise his role. I don't know if Gina Davis or Alec Baldwin are reprising their roles as the Maitlands either. I mean, I'm just excited to see what we got. We know it's coming out in September of this year, I believe. So, man, I'm just excited to see what this is. So, I'm going to watch it with y'all. Y'all going to watch it with me. We're going to have our thoughts and emotions together in three, two, one, now. Wait, did he white girl? Okay, that's an Ortega. That's the bridge they died off of. But you took the soul out of Dale. Who's you Lydia, her daughter. It's Jux! They killed him! That is sad, I can tell The attic. Okay, Jenna sees the attic. She sees the city. The juice is loose. All right. Oh, he looks evil this time around. I, okay. So, of course, it's a teaser trail. It's just enough to get you hype about it. Jen Ortega, I'm assuming from what we see, in this trailer, she's gonna be the one to say the words to let him out. But how does he get? I know he got his head shrunk at the end of the first one after the sandworms ate him. Um, I want. I just wonder what's gonna happen with the Maitlands too. You know, to see um, his his daughter, the daughter, to see Captain O'Hara's character. I'm trying to remember. Delia. Delia Dietz. My brain was like, you remember the name. Delia is still there. Charles must be dead. Because that was the best way to write him off. Like, yo, he's dead. But the bridge where the Maitlands fell through and how they died is there. The school for girls that Lydia went to. Went, so all that is great. I don't know, again, to see the, the model of the town. There's a, I'm not going to try to just consistently nitpick into this because it's not much. Out, out of a minute and 14 seconds, it's not a lot. But it is enough to get you excited. Uh, Michael Keaton, like I said, he looks more evil, like he's got a gripe. Now, I don't know if uh, we're going to have the comedic level, which we did. I'm hoping Tim Burton still keeps that same feel because it was a horror comedy. You know, and, and I, I want that same thing with this one. I want to see... You know, Beetlejuice doing the stupid stuff and all the little gags. I want to see something 
uh, a jump in the line type gag brought for 2024. I'm so mad they took Harry. <sighs> it kids Bob Dale. I hate it so much. But nonetheless, I digress. I'm back. And I want to know your thoughts on this teaser trailer. Like, we can't go super far in depth. But let me know your thoughts in the comments down below. Y'all already know the drill here. Like, subscribe, click on the notification bell, man. I'm coming back with a lot more videos, a lot more reviews. I owe y'all so much. And this is how I can give it back to you. You already know, find me on Instagram and TikTok. M-R-J-A-Y. You should know how to spell Washington. Uh, if you've been following me over there, thank you so much. Everybody who's showing love with the reaction videos, the stand-up clips, um, and more. Also, if you're in Los Angeles... Saturday, May 11th, 7 p.m. at the West Side Comedy Theater in Santa Monica. I will be headlining a night of the Netflix is a Joke Comedy Festival. I will have the link in the bio to get your tickets. Um, make sure you do that. We're almost sold out, so I want to see y'all in the building for that. I'm glad to be back. We're going to have some fun. I'll talk to y'all soon. Bye. <laughs>